Hi dolls, welcome back, and if you're new, hello, my name is Jessie, and today we're going to react to Season 1, Episode 7 of Chainsaw Man, Taste of Kiss, and at the end of the last episode, we have Denji jumping into the mouth of the Infinity Monster. I am excited, though, because you know he's gonna chainsaw out, so let's just jump in. Season 1, Episode 7 of Chainsaw Man, Taste of a Kiss. Yeah! Now all of them are gonna get a chance to see this and see what is actually up with Denji. He keeps saying that. You won't find my heart in here. Ooh, he's biting and everything. Ooh! さん。ええ。道が邪魔に照らせ。まともだから悪魔の攻撃を怖がっちゃう。恐怖が悪魔の力になるからな。で、ネジがぶっ飛んでるやつは何を考えてるかわからない。悪魔も理解できんもんはこ
<笑>あ、ファディブラーナ。ゲロに集まったら。ああ。ひめの先輩には自制心が足りないんだ。あちゃよ。ファースト what did she do? Kirohonda this one's really interesting. Eh, it's like a video game. That's cool. This may be one of my favorite ones. <laughs> it's like a rainbow vomit stream. Alright, so there you have it. Episode 7, Taste of a Kiss. And Denji sure got a taste, alright. So we start off where he is wrecking this infinity devil and uh, his plan works. So they get out and they party. What else better to do than party, right? Himeno, um, mmm. Okay, I'm getting a little sick because Jimeno is really growing on me in this episode, very making me very, very curious. And then we get to the point where she's so drunk and she gives Denji the kiss and she pukes in his mouth. She then proceeds to take him home. She's so drunk. I don't know if she's pretending to be drunk or if she's actually that. Like, I think she's that drunk, but I don't know if she's pretending to be like, oh, how did you get here? Because she's like, what are you doing in my place? You brought him there. But I don't I don't know. I don't know what's going on with her. All I know is the very, very end, the last second, she's like, do you want to do it? And I'm very curious to see if they do, because I feel like Denji will be a new person once this happens. I did not know that Denji was 16. Uh, makes sense as to why he's such a hornball. Um, I'm curious to to find out Jimeno's age. Anyway, Kobeni, I'm very confused. I, I can't wait to go back and edit this because I, as I've said before, I see a lot of things and hear a lot of things that I may have missed or didn't quite understand at first. Did they say Kobeni's had, had, had Kobeni had eight sisters and they all died? the fuck is going on there? And then Makima shows up and is like, oh, Denji's kind of smooching it up and doesn't seem to really give a crap, which is what I was alluding to in the last episode. I think that she's just flirting with Denji and Hayakawa to kind of get what she wants. And that might stop working if Denji sleeps with someone. Uh, he just might open new doors to new possibilities, but I don't know because he was even saying like, oh, I don't want her to kiss me because Makima's here now and I didn't know Makima's going to be here. So I don't know. It's very, very interesting. We find out a little bit more about the other characters. Um, Hagakawa says it's not smart to confess what contract you have with the devil. So I'm very curious to see what Kobeni's contract is because she's all like sweet and innocent and nervous and chaotic. And I just feel like something chaotic and crazy is going to happen with with her. I mean, we get a little flashback of Pushta, even if it has to do with rats eating vomit. We still got a flashback of Pushta, and I love Pushta. Oh, and Sammy came to visit, my little Sammy. You're my little Pushta. Oh my god, we should change your name to Pushta. You would, that would be cute. But anyway, good episode. It was a fun episode. It wasn't too crazy or chaotic. Um, I do kind of have a lump in my chest now, and I kind of want to puke a little bit, but that's okay, and we'll have to see what happens next week. <laughs> Everyone throw a like over this, like if you do, do not like what you see, but comment down below a little bit wise, subscribe if you have not yet, we do fun things here, ring the link, the button to be notified when I upload new videos, don't forget to check the link down in the description for my Patreon, follow us on all social media, but that is it. So long, everyone. Try to make someone smile today. You never know when you might need it next. Bye.